Welcome back to the update. So today, an arrest was made in the murder of Bob Lee, the founder of Cash App and inventor of Moby. He was murdered in San Francisco on April 4th under suspicious circumstances. And because he was attacked in San Francisco, it was widely thought that he was randomly killed by a transient or mentally ill homeless person. Now, I may have been the only person saying it wasn't random when it first all happened and made our last video stating just that. And in fact, he was stabbed twice in the chest by a man he knew and was in the car with right before getting out and being killed by the driver of that car a fellow tech exec named Nima Momeni. Nima, the owner of Expanded, a computer support and security services company, was picked up at his residence in Emeryville, California, about 20 minutes outside of San Francisco. Now all that's been said is Bob knew the man who killed him, not how well, not the nature of their relationship. It was speculated that they may have had an argument in the car. I say speculated because no one knows for sure. Bob got out and was stabbed two times in the chest with a four inch kitchen knife. It was 2.30 in the morning. Those are the facts. I won't speculate on the reason they were together at 2.30 a.m. I won't speculate on his sexuality, though it is known he left behind a wife and two beautiful young daughters. I don't know if alcohol was at play, or where they were, or how much time they spent together before this happened. But what I do know about him was his credentials. And like I said in our last video, that in itself can be telling. Check it out. So, knowing that he was an inventor and an angel investor, he probably had some products coming out that may or may not have been getting in the way of FedNow. Fed now will be the funnel that all money gets cycled through. It will go from your bank to Fed now to wherever you're trying to send the money to. So, for instance, if you're trying to buy something from Instacart or you're, anything you're buying online, Amazon, it's going to go from your bank to Fed now to Amazon, Walmart, wherever it is you're going to. Now, this is a problem. This is a major problem because now. The federal government has full access to your bank account. Right. When the federal government is in complete control of your money and can see every dollar you spend, that is a problem for most folks. And when the federal government can't do all of that, that's a problem for the Fed. So back to when I said Bob may or may not have had a product coming out that would have gotten in the way of Fed now. Well, he did. It was his dream project, and it was called Moby. Moby came out on January 11th of this year and was a product for the people. It was a digital privacy wallet that allows peer-to-peer -peer payments as well as to retailers. It's actually pretty cool. It also allows the user to pay anyone that they can text from their phone dog. And personally, I don't think having Bob around to promote and further develop that app was sitting well with certain folks. There you have it. Please like and subscribe if you appreciated the video. And of course, thanks for watching.